Tuesday mornings are sales meetings at Bethesda Gateway's office. And uh, I'm lucky enough to only live two miles from the office, so I get to take my scooter, which I find is uh, much more enjoyable than sitting in traffic in my car. Especially when it's not a million degrees as it is usually in DC. So it's like 75 degrees today, which is uh, uh, beautiful by DC standards. So this is the start of something that I've been thinking about doing for about, oh, five years, which is to show you guys what being in real estate's really about. I've been in residential real estate since 2005, I run a successful team of five agents at Long & Foster, which is our region's largest uh, local realtor. We also happen to be owned by Berkshire Hathaway, so that doesn't hurt. I see that everyone is just obsessed with home and HGTV, and where that gives you a little insight into what we do, it really doesn't give you the insight into what the lifestyle is really like, because real estate really isn't a career or a profession, it's a lifestyle. So uh, we're gonna do a little bit of, let you in a little bit on the inside life. Got a busy day ahead of me, meeting with uh, my marketing group, also meeting with my team. I've been out of town for two weeks and I have to catch up on what's going on in their lives. Currently trying to uh, get more information about a listing that one of our clients is interested in. It's this really cool contemporary over in Arlington, Virginia. Contemporaries aren't the norm in our market, so when they come up, you kind of have to jump on them. Right now I'm driving through Chevy Chase, Maryland. So this is a, a neighborhood that's right on the DC line. So where I'm sitting right now, I'm one mile from Washington, D.C. The benefits to the uh, 50cc scooter is that I can park anywhere I want. So I can easily just pull it in behind the office, throw it up on the sidewalk, and we're good to go for the rest of the day. Uh, I find that also is helpful when I'm showing property down in D.C. because you're in the middle of D.C. Finding parallel parking or garage spot near where you want to be is super difficult. So I use uh, sometimes scooter, sometimes the boosted board, Sometimes just my feet. We've been known to Uber to meetings, just to make it easier on making sure that we are maximizing the use of our time and we're not spending 30 to 40 minutes circling the block looking for a parking spot. It is pretty funny though when I show up to show a house on a skateboard, people get a little, a little chuckle out of it. So to my right over there is Columbia Country Club. It's one of the two country clubs that's on Connecticut Avenue in Chevy Chase. Got golf, tennis, swimming pool, social club. Also has one of the best 4th of July fireworks celebrations in the DC area. All right, just like that, we've entered Bethesda. So Bethesda is not a town. It's just a district in the uh, Montgomery County region. To our right is Bethesda Chevy Chase High School. That's where my kids go to school where I went to school and then we're coming into downtown Bethesda here we are the back entrance into my office oh and look at that someone left my parking spot for me all right coffee in hand only about five minutes late now, let's get this day started. I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna balance recording this stuff without feeling like a complete goofball talking to myself as I walk around town. But then again, I've never really cared in the past. So I guess I won't care now. Good morning. And here we are. This is the uh, Smart Living Team headquarters. So off to my meeting, bye. Had a great sales meeting this morning, talked about some new listings that we have coming up in Arlington, Virginia, and also in Kensington, Maryland. Right now I am uh, on my way to meet a client and a contractor. We have a closing for this property on this Friday. And then our buyer is planning to do some uh, significant kitchen renovations before they move in. So one of the things we like to do is get them lined up with their contractors before closing so that they know 
what to expect and have it ready by the time they get uh, get done. Right now I'm on Rock Creek, I'm in Rock Creek Park on Beach Drive. Beach Drive is this amazing national park system that runs all the way through uh, Montgomery County in Washington, D.C. Basically, if I stayed on this road, it would take me all the way down to the National Zoo and to the Lincoln Memorial. So it's pretty nice. It's a quick little shortcut. As you can see, I'm about to see one of our natives here. Here is a deer. Uh, deers in Washington, D.C. aren't afraid of anything. So they just walk across the street, come in your front yard, eat your trees, whatever they want. So we're pulling into Parkwood, which is uh, one of my favorite Kensington neighborhoods. I've actually lived in this neighborhood for many years and uh, currently own some rental property back here. It's a neighborhood where the prices start around 500,000 for a house to tear down and range up to the $1.5 million mark uh, with a few standouts at 1.6 every now and again. You can see there's a lot of infill construction going on. People are taking the smaller houses and turning them into 5,000 square foot homes. And the real big perk of this neighborhood is it borders the park the entire time, entire place. So that's why they call it Parkwood. So if you're into hiking, biking, uh, running, this is a great location. You're also only two miles to downtown Bethesda, a mile to the metro, and uh, makes a really good, convenient commuter neighborhood. So you'll notice on my left-hand side behind these houses is the park. And some of these houses have waterfront views where you can see the, uh, the creek that runs through the park. It's actually such a great neighborhood that the client I'm about to meet is moving in the neighborhood. They like it so much they didn't want to leave, they just wanted more space. And here we are, five minutes early.